Good morning, everyone. When I say today is the day that your girl is stepping out on faith and actually going to her next dream city. Um, Y'all, it's been a journey. It has been a really journey for me. And I was like, what better way for me not to document everything um, on my channel? Because like, I'm only, I'm not only doing this for you guys, but I'm also doing this for myself too. And, you know, I'm actually getting myself together to leave, to go to the airport. Um, my flight is at 2.49, um, but I'm going to get there a little early because as y'all know, this Memorial Day and, you know, traffic is really crazy. Um, you also know that, um, how it is at the airport. So I want to get there early and be able to sit there and, um, you know, get my mind together because I'm literally leaving all of like a leap of faith. Like, um, I've been through a lot, you guys, and, you know, a lot of doors has just been, you know, shitting on me, but it's okay. I always told myself is to never give up on myself and to never give up on my dream. So today is the day. As y'all know, I got my bunny on. Bitch, y'all like, girl, what is you doing with your bunny on? But I want y'all to see the real cuts, the raw everything. So um, I'm actually about to get ready to spend a little time with my little brothers um, before I leave. This is really a bittersweet moment for me, but I'm going to document everything to show you guys that I'm actually leaving like faith. Like all I got is a dream and I got God. So um, hopefully this video inspires you guys to go after your dream, not knowing that, you know, what's next for you. You don't know um, where you're going to be. You don't know who you're going to be around. You just don't know. You just know that you got to get there. So come with me with this journey and yeah. So y'all, I really had to just make this clip again because y'all know how YouTube is. Um, the radio was playing and I don't want YouTube to be like, copyright, copyright, I ain't got time for that. But we are actually on the way to the airport. We had to make a few stops. Um, and actually my dad is taking me to the airport. I'm super excited. The weather is amazing. I feel good, even though this is like a life-changing experience that's about to happen but y'all don't understand like i really feel so good like i feel amazing right now and you know it was bittersweet having to leave my little brother you know leave you know my grandmother it was bittersweet having to leave them because i didn't want them to be upset but i was so glad that i was able to give my little brother something that he's been dying to get and of course he was like oh my gosh you got this for me and want to give me a hug um you know i was able to get up in the morning to fix my grandmother her breakfast and spend time with my little brother and i was actually i gave something to my mom you know even though she didn't know i was leaving but i honestly wanted to give her something you know just because you know that's the gift to me um, but I'm actually so excited, y'all. Like, I really am excited. Like, the more the more we get closer to the airport, it's like kind of a bittersweet moment. I don't know if I'm going to cry, but I feel like the conversation that me and my dad is having is actually bringing me a lot of good energy. It's bringing me a lot of good vibes. You know, we're talking about dreams. We're talking about goals and things that we really want to achieve in our life. And of course, he said, you know, he want these things. I'm like, you just don't know your daughter is going to get you these things. And I'm excited. So um, I will actually be back on here when we get to the airport. But yeah. Hey, y'all. Welcome back. I have made it to the airport. Um, I had a little bittersweet moment, y'all. I was crying. Um... And of course, when I got up there through the thing, of course I had to throw uh, some stuff away, but it's okay because God got more for me. Y'all, it, it was some liquid stuff, but it's okay. But as y'all see, I made it to the airport. Literally got my book and I literally have what I have on me. That's it, as y'all can see. That's all I have on me. And I really, 
don't know where I'm like supposed to be at right now. Um, actually flying with Delta. <sighs> y'all, I just want y'all to know whatever that feels like is stopping you from going after your dreams. Y'all gonna literally see this video and this is going to inspire y'all to go after y'all dream. So do it, even if you feel scared, um, do it. Like I'm literally doing it, prime example, and I'm actually showing you guys that I'm doing it. You can do it too. There's so many people that travel every day and I'm sorry if I'm kind of out of breath right now, but it's because of course I'm a little nervous I'm not gonna say that, but it's a good feeling that I'm nervous. But my flight do not depart until 2.49. And I'm actually about to go to the bathroom, get myself together. Um, of course I said my dad dropped me off and he basically was just telling me, make sure you just keep in touch. And I was like, I will. But I was crying, y'all. I was crying. Like, I really was crying. Good thing I didn't have my good makeup on. But I'm here. And hopefully, you guys, um, but don't cry if you if you are watching this Passengers video. Passengers are advised to closely control the area and check baggage and packages to um, avoid transporting this because this was literally knowledge. motivation. Please like, report this and any other motivation, but an I'm going to talk to you guys officer. a couple seconds as soon as I go check in. Okay, y'all. So, I have got checked in. And my good thing is not a lot of people here. Like, I'm really excited that it's not a lot of people here because I really like to be by myself. Um, of course, it's a holiday, um, as I know. So I thought that the airport would have really been packed because it's a holiday. But I have not been at an airport in so long, y'all. It's, it's like, I don't know how to feel right now, y'all. Like, I have not been, been in the airport for so long, but just knowing that like God literally like ordained this for me like he just literally ordained this y'all like and I felt like you know y'all been rocking with me for a very long time and I just want to show you guys that like you know I'm literally stepping out on faith too you know I'm going to my dream city and I was not going to tell y'all until I got to the airport but I'm actually going to Atlanta and um, I wrote it down and I'm just like, God, like, I don't know. You know, of course my dad was like, do you know, you know, where you gonna go? Like, do you know, like, who you gonna stay with? But he knew that I had a dream and I'm just like, I don't know, like, you know, I literally put my trust and my all into God. So I literally want y'all to realize that like, I don't even know myself, but, I would never forget when I look back at this video and y'all actually see the growth and see the change. Like, it's gonna even shock me. But um, I wish I could um, record a little bit being on the airplane, but I don't think it's gonna be a lot of people on the plane. So I really do hope that I have a window seat because I love the window, you know. I love to see stuff. But y'all, I'm here. Like, I'm literally here. Like, I'm literally here. And the lightning is so good. Like, the weather is so good. Like, God's really gonna have me on the cloud looking at this beautiful thing that he done created. Y'all, I'm just so nervous. But I'm, I'm, just, I'm nervous. It's a good nervous. But I want y'all to realize that Atlanta has always been a city that I have always grew at. Like, I used to come to Atlanta. Um, I used to come to Atlanta. I'm sorry, y'all. My hand is a little hurting right now. But I used to come to Atlanta all the time. Like, when we used to um, go out on my cousin, um, he actually stays in Atlanta. 
Um, you know, he used to invite me to events. We used to always go to Atlanta to go to the parties um, or just have fun. Atlanta used to always be where I used to do my branding content, shoot my videos at. And it's just something was in my head was just like, that's where you need to be because I'm like, that's where I go. And it's like, I have a good time when I'm in Atlanta. I flourish when I'm in Atlanta. I get opportunities when I'm in Atlanta. And it's like, that's where I need to go. And I don't have any kids, no responsibility. And I'm kind of glad that this, this is the lifestyle that God has chose for me because I like to be on the go. And the man at the gate, when I was checking in, he was telling me, he was like, you need to sign up. He was like, it's totally free. He was like, you know, um, I think for you, it's for free for a year, but you can fly for like, for some miles or something. Um, I get they give you um, some miles that you can fly up to without, um, I don't know y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all when I get the paperwork, but it's just so much. I'm like, dang, God, God had this for me. God was like, God, and this, God was like, I'm gonna give you some more miles. You think you finna go to Atlanta, girl? You think to be traveling, okay? But I'm here, y'all, and y'all will see me at Atlanta Airport. So y'all, I made it to Atlanta. I made it to Atlanta. Um, I actually stopped and got me something to eat. I'm about to get on the train. Well, this is the train to get to the other train. Um, but y'all, I was really dehydrated. Um, before we took out from the other flight, ooh, before we took out for the other flight, I was really like, hot, like really hot. So I had to get me a drink. And the girl is about to get on this train, y'all. It's gonna be so fast. Now, it would feel good since I ate because I didn't eat, but I'm okay. I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. But I'm about to be on this train for a minute to go to my next stop. I'm excited. And I hope y'all are excited too. Oh my gosh, I pray that this video it's and I guess I'm gonna say inspire. I mean inspire inspire you guys my words are missing but I'm on the train and it's about to move and next stop is for domestic fashion and uh stop so yeah I know how these things work please please so y'all yeah, i just got off the other train i'm about to head on to the other train um but when i tell y'all when y'all come to the airport please 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 know where you're going because if you don't know where you're going then you're gonna be lost as fuck <laughs> Hopefully, I'm going to the right for it. Hopefully. So, y'all, I just got my ticket to go to Peachtree. This little thing moving slow. I just got my ticket. Um, the lady, I told her, I said, it's my first time getting on a train like this. And she told me, she was like, oh, girl, you good. She told me one up for a 350. And I always said I wanted to ride a train. And she asked me where I was going, and I told her Peachtree. And y'all, oh my gosh, this is my first time hopping on a train. I'm excited. It's just so different. It's different. 
I'm trying to, I'm, right, I'm trying to um, capture everything because I don't even know, like, we don't, I don't even know, but first time for everything. That's good, that's great to try. Yeah, out. this is my first time. I was like, oh my God, I never did a train before and now I actually done it, so. That shit was cool. So, we are. Where they need to be on East Street East or West. East Street East, so where's okay? I, this is East. Oh, yeah, East over here. Okay. Okay, why my little thing not working? There we go. I was finna say now. It wasn't clicking. Yeah, I got it through it. I think we gotta we gotta go out that way again or you gonna go to that side? Oh, okay. Well, I'm just trying I'm just trying to see some 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 sun because I don't know. <laughs> oh okay. Oh my gosh! Wow! Do y'all see this? literally got to go all the way up here literally y'all but oh my god do y'all see how long this is i ain't never ever in my life been on an escalator like this never ever y'all listen go after your dreams i don't care what's stopping you go like go you gotta make that move. You gotta like let God, like even when you don't know where you gonna go, let God guide you. If you got a vision and you know you gotta get out your hometown or you feel like you can't grow, the people that you around, listen, you just gotta go and let God do the rest. Cause I was literally at the airport, was like, I don't know where I'm gonna go. I don't know what I'm about to do, but I literally did it. So. Yeah, I'm gonna cry when I look back at this video. I promise myself I'm gonna cry. But, whoo, this escalator here. Yeah. It's a workout. Y'all see how? Literally. Wow. Wow. Y'all see how? Wow. Wow, 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 wow. This is amazing. And I literally had to ask her. I said, where'd it go? Because I didn't know. But, yeah, I'm out of breath. I got my juice. But I see y'all when I get to some sun, okay? <laughs> pop your shit, let them know. Let them know. Like. Yeah, what's happening, man? Zone one, Westside Dutch in the building, man. You know, I'm out here kicking with my foe on Peach Street in the, in the motherfucking. Peach Street, you feel Peach me? Street motherfucker in the building. You know, city shit, man. You know, just cooling it back to fire up. Kicking with this broom for y'all later right here. She about to blow up on you know, the YouTube shit going up Period. through the roof. Fucking right, fucking right. Yeah, uh-huh, you, you heard him. Go roll me, wind up, man, and kick back, man. You already know. Hey, y'all. So, y'all already know we are back with another video. I'm over here saying like it's another video, but y'all get the message. But we made it. Y'all. I'm excited and I really so excited to take y'all on this journey with me because it has literally been a journey like from y'all rocking with me even when I was at the other state which I was actually in Charlotte, Charlotte North Carolina but now I'm in Atlanta Georgia and it's like when I got here the vibes like as soon as I touched down the vibes was already here I'm excited to really, 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 really take y'all with this journey with me. This will be the last video for this vlog. Um, I really wanted to say that I hope this video 
really motivate you guys to go after your dreams and to never give up on yourself no matter what your situation is and i always told y'all before literally manifest like manifestation is literally so important like you just gotta believe in yourself like if you believe in yourself you'll get it but i had to realize that you gotta surround yourself around people who you want to grow with i had to learn that like you can't hang around people who's just not in your vibration so if you have a, a high vibration then you gotta be around high vibrational people if you're around low vibrational people who drain your energy not on the like the mindset level that you are on then it's gonna make you get discouraged onto your dream and to your goal so i'm really making this just to say that i'm living proof that as long as you believe in yourself like no matter what nobody tells you like you gotta really believe in yourself and have a really strong mindset about what you want to do in your life and that's the thing like even when the goal doesn't make sense like you really 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 gotta like like have a true like your mind gotta be bigger than anything when it's when it comes to your dreams like can't nobody stop you your mom your dad your grandma your sister your brother like can't nobody like no matter what they say can't stop you so see y'all in the next video make sure y'all like comment and subscribe like i said like comment and subscribe but y'all stay tuned to the next video Make sure you go subscribe.